today we're going to continue on with what we did in the last video which was the stand or the table for extra space and even just a boost because I'm six foot eight so in this video we're going to be making the basics of a a uh, knife bevel jig now I've seen other designs online where there's just angle iron drilled in and with some washers and stuff like that I've seen complex ones professional ones but what I want to do is make it out of wood I have some hinges as you can see I've already kind of designed everything get you guys a little bit closer got some hinges and I even have this because everything I'm not very uh, coordinated so if I had to adjust two washers to get the same amount I would be screwed so I got this piece in hopes that all I have to do is adjust the center piece and it will do the rest. It'll make everything even. But the pieces that I had that we're going to connect to connect to this and this were too small for the wood. I couldn't get it through. I couldn't get the bolts or anything. So I'm just going to do one part and then the next part which will be a jump cut or a couple seconds for you guys it would be the problem will be resolved so we're gonna get started i'm just gonna cut out the shape and make kind of a hinge right now until i can get the other piece so if you're cool with that and down with that let's get to it So, I've got that where it opens and closes. Obviously, I gotta do something about the nails, which that won't be that hard. I'm just gonna angle grind. So I did get some bigger pieces that will be working, it still works, still got to sand all that but I'm going to be doing that once everything else. Now these I realized a little too late that they, this is kind of a thick piece of wood which is what I wanted but it's a little too thick. So I'm going to take a little piece of plywood. I'm going to make sure everything's in the frame. I'm going to actually put a little excess like in the middle right here and up here so that this piece will sit like right there. So when I adjust, it's going to adjust how I want it. And eventually I may actually even put up some like handles so I can just kind of grab it and go like that. 
but that'll be down the road. I think that's the more I go this nope that's the wrong way so as I go turn it I can actually get it however far I need And whenever I'm done using it, it doesn't close up as nicely as it did. I could always unscrew these parts and fold it up. But, it does close up to about that, which for good enough. But as I will probably be, I will probably have it a little past the 90 degrees. I'll probably keep it like right there. 